that nodding syndrome does not exist in Uganda alone. There is nodding syndrome in South Sudan, there is nodding syndrome in Tanzania, and in other countries. Nodding syndrome has been associated to onchocerciasis or the black fly, the simulium flies. And during research, it was found very clearly that it is an autoimmune reaction to the worm that gets into the body. The body produces antibodies against it. Antibodies are armies that go to fight yeah. the worm. But the protein that they attack on the worm is also in the brain. So the antibodies also turn and attack the same protein. And that is why we end up with nodding syndrome. But onchocerciasis itself also causes river blindness. And that is why the patients also get blind. Now, the unfortunate thing is that it is a neurological disorder. And when you continue having seizures, eventually you get brain damage. And I want to repeat this, there are no new cases. Research has shown there are no new cases. Why are there no new cases? Because the communities have embraced ivermectin. Ivermectin reduces on the filaria that is in the body, the worm that is in the body that causes the damage. And what researchers are doing now, they are looking for a way of killing the adult worm. Because once the adult worm is in the body, it doesn't die. It lives for over five years. It continues to produce the filaria. If you don't swallow the ivermectin, the filaria will be in your body and eventually you will get nodding syndrome if you are a child. Once we find a drug that gets rid of the adult worm, we will be able to get rid of nodding syndrome. But as it is now, that research is going on.